this is just a regular light bulb. Right. <laughs> but I'm only interested in its insides. Oh, This my. is because I've been curious to see what happens if I plug it in without the bulb. You're going to burn out the filament. Yep. It actually lasted a lot longer than I expected. Because the bulb keeps the filament, the little strip of metal, for undergoing rapid oxidation and burning itself out. But it basically just burned. There's one other thing that I've been really wanting to try, though, and for that, I had to sacrifice another bulb. Okay, sure. Then I got some liquid nitrogen, and I carefully lowered it in. So is he just making another bulb, putting a nitrogen blanket on it, a liquid nitrogen blanket? Now, if I turn it on, it doesn't just immediately burn. It's basically acting as another filament, and because it's a liquid, it's keeping it more in than if you were to just pressurize nitrogen gas on something that's not a container. This is because the liquid nitrogen is surrounding the filament with nitrogen gas and protecting yeah. it from air and oxygen. It's actually kind of acting like the bulb, <laughs> which is often just filled with nitrogen gas. And I think this is pretty cool. A very convoluted way to make a light bulb. Is he a nuclear engineer? 